The position to now still as we entered this morning, there is no final court decision issued. The, the, the court indicated that they will hold a second hearing in these proceedings and come back to the court. We don't know if they will conduct a second hearing with or not. And we raised our arguments and we, we, uh, we told our arguments fully to the court. We still hope that the court will approve our permission to appeal and accept the appeal and cancel the, uh, uh, the uh, eviction orders against the four families uh, uh, that we argued on their behalf, on their behalf today in court. Today, um, the Israeli colonial court refused all responsibility to make a decision. Um, they stalled and they placed immense pressure on us to make a decision, to make us to, to reach a settlement with the Israeli settler organizations. Obviously, we, we will never pay rent to people who do not own our homes, and we, we wish the Israeli court would finally make a, make a decision. This has been 49 years of postponement and stalling, and this tactic of um, delaying is not going to work anymore. The entire world's eyes is on Sheikh Jarrah, and we know that this system was built by land theft, was built by subjugating Palestinians, and it will never be fair to us.